So what was your reaction to the BK ad? So I thought it was certainly shocking. It had that shock factor. It was, you know, a viral video, an image, but it's not going to make me want to go out to Burger King. Yeah, totally. I thought it was bold and I liked it for that reason, um, but I'm not convinced that it's going to encourage visitation to right. their stores. Why do you think Burger King did it? Um, Well, we both talked about the BuzzFeed video that came out back in 2014 that showed all these different fast food chain burgers decomposing in jars, and McDonald's showed the least amount of decay, so I think they were definitely kind of playing off that um, viral sensation and showing just how much decay is on their burger. I also wonder if it was a potential distraction away from that conversation earlier around declining sales of the Impossible Whopper, so that's kind of been in the past, and now we're moving towards this whole conversation of removing artificial ingredients and preservatives. Yes, focusing more on their signature menu item again. So do you think this is something that consumers want? So according to my quick service restaurants report, consumers definitely do want to see natural fast food items and that means they want to see fast food that's free of artificial ingredients and free of antibiotics. Um, I don't know that consumers want to see mold on their food. (laughs) Right. I think this is becoming an expectation for all consumers that the food they're eating isn't going to contain some of these ingredients, but I don't think that it's necessarily going to increase visitation among Burger King's core consumers or increase the likelihood that a non-visitor is going to make up make that visit but I do think it's you know starting that conversation and making that conversation that operators like Panera and Chipotle have talked about in the past but making it very visual for the consumer which I think is something we haven't really seen yet. Totally. Yeah, it's definitely catching up with some competitors like McDonald's, who's already uh, removed artificial ingredients from the Big Mac, um, except for the pickles, and a lot of their other burgers. So uh, yeah, it is just meeting that new consumer expectation around natural ingredients, um, for sure. So what do you think this means for Burger King's competitors? Well, I think we will see some reaction probably from Wendy's and McDonald's. I know Wendy's has been super vocal historically, especially on Twitter. They're not afraid to sort of speak their mind. So I would expect to see some sort of response and potentially similar commitments being made by some of the major players in the fast food space. So I think this is really just the start of this conversation. Yeah.